Hello, my name is Angela. Today is June 11th, 2017. Yesterday I purchased a brand new Kia Soul EV. It's a 2016, though, so one year older model. So I'm going to give you a tour right now and we're going to see how it is living with an electric vehicle. Currently it's plugged up to my house and it's charging overnight. Well, it did charge overnight because I got it yesterday. And it's a black one. Let's see. We'll go inside. It's leather seats. It tells you it's 84% charged. It'll take another four hours for it to be completely charged. This is a huge monitor. And huge sunroof move view and plenty of room in the back okay so now i'm back in the car i have the key with me and i'm just going to show you how i started so i just put my foot on the brake just a regular push to start and it's on As you can see, it really is June 11th, and I charged this last night for probably about 9 or 10 hours. It gave me 81 miles and 84% battery. I think this is like the most battery I've had since I had the car. And this is what the dash says, but that's where it says the driving range. And... And these are the two modes that you drive in. It's D mode or B mode, which is brake mode. And brake mode really saves on electricity and power, and you can get more mileage off this one. So this is the one that I will be driving in mainly. And then this is an active eco button that you have to press, and it turns on this green eco light, and it allows you to save you know, some miles when you're driving. So the cool thing is, if you are running low, this Uvo or the EV button will tell you where the nearby stations are. So the closest one is two miles from my house I live. And then if you click, it will tell you a little information. This is a level two charger. So the ones you have at your house are level one. And they take like 12 hours to charge, which is a really long time. But if you're doing it while you're sleeping, who cares? But the level two chargers, they're about four to six hours. And then some at like the dealerships or other places, they have um, really cool DC chargers that charge in like under 30 minutes, depending on your car. So that's just a quick tour. I'm gonna go run some errands and we'll see what happens at the end of my first full day with my electric vehicle. Cool. Okay, so my first full day is basically over. I just have to go out one more time, but while I'm home for like the next four hours, I'm just gonna charge the car. I'll just show you how I set it up. So I keep it in the trunk. Get in. So now it's kind of like sneaked out. I'll fix that. First I have to unlock the gas thing. So I just press this open and it opens by itself. And then you press that. It pops open. You take this. See if it hooked up. Okay, so these blue indicators come on, letting you know that it's charging. And now it's saying it's going to take 12 hours and 20 minutes to charge. Currently, my car is 62%. That's the end of day one. And to make this look cuter, what I do is I just I sneak it through the sidewalk.
and then I don't want to trip on it when I go up my front step. I also want to keep it kind of conspicuous. Now the sidewalk is like 